Welcome. Today, we will be talking about the grid method of multiplication. Grid method requires splitting numbers into their place value before they are multiplied, that is, splitting into ones, tens, hundreds depending on the highest place value of the number. Let's try this. 34 times 2. The first step is to split the numbers to be multiplied. 34 will be split to 30 and 4. 2 will remain as it is because only has 1's place value. Then draw a grid and insert the split numbers in the grids, leaving a space for the multiplication sign in the top left grid. We have 30 in the second grid and 4 in the third grid on top. And 2, which is the second number, will be in the grid in the left hand side. Now, we start multiplication. The numbers in the top columns will be multiplied by each number in the left hand row. We have 2 times 30, the product is 60. It will be written at the intersection of the two numbers being multiplied. To the next side, we have 2 times 4, the result, which is 8, will be written at the intersection of the two numbers being multiplied. Now, we add all the products together, we have 60 plus 8, the result is 68. Let's try this too, 37 times 15. We will split the numbers to be multiplied into tens and units. 37 will be split into 30 and 7, and 15 will be split into 10 and 5. Then, we draw a grid that will suit the problem and add the multiplication sign in the top left grid and insert the splitted numbers into grid. The greater number preferably in the top grids. So, we have 30 in the second grid and 7 in the third grid. We insert the second splits in the left grids in order of decreasing place value. That means we have 10 first and then 5 in the row below. Now, we multiply the numbers in the top column by each of the number in the left hand row. We have 10 times 30, the result, which is 300, will be written at the intersection of the numbers being multiplied. The first number in the left hand row to multiply the second number in the top column. We have 10 times 7, the result is 70, which will be written at the intersection of the numbers being multiplied. 5 times 30, the result is 150. The result will be written at the intersection of the numbers being multiplied. And 5 times 7, the result is 35. The result will be written at the intersection of the numbers being multiplied. The next step is to add all the products together. We have 300 plus 70 plus 150 plus 35. The sum equals 555. Now, try solving these with the grid method. 16 times 9 and 23 times 13. The answer is 144 and 299 respectively bye see you next time if you've enjoyed this video please like and remember to subscribe to our youtube channel and click on notification bell to get notified when we upload new videos smart myths be the smartest